a lot of people really like the video I did about how to record using a USB microphone, your headset, or the microphone built into your PlayStation camera on the PlayStation 4 so that you can do voiceovers when you use your share button to record your gameplay. So everybody asked me, a lot of people asked me actually, um, how do you record your friends as well? So say if you guys are in a party and you want to include everybody's voices into your gameplay video, how do you do that? Well today I'm going to show you. It's fairly simple, but it's one of those things if you don't know what you're doing or what things to turn on and, and where the settings are, you'd probably be lost for ages. So um, just follow these settings, but before we start, you have to make sure that whoever you want to record their voice, whoever is in the party with you, or any friend that you intend to do this with at some point, you have to make sure that they follow all these steps as well. Because if they don't activate the ability to be recorded, or the ability to be heard in the party, or their microphone level isn't right, they just won't be in your video. It's, it's as simple as that, really. Um, you also have to make sure that when you do these steps, you have your microphone already plugged in. So that can be your headset or a USB microphone, whatever you like. So let's get started. It's quite simple. First thing we need to do is, um, whether you're in your dashboard or in a game, just press the share button and then go down to sharing and broadcast settings. Then audio sharing settings then you click on the little box that says include microphone audio in video clips and then just below that you'll see share party audio click that box as well okay so go back into your game or your dashboard and then make sure your microphone's plugged in hold down your playstation button and then on the left hand side at the top there click on sound and devices then click on adjust microphone level on the right there and then turn your microphone level to the top. Now I have to tell you, if you plug in a new microphone, your microphone level automatically go down again and you have to calibrate it for the new microphone each time you switch a microphone. Um, but make sure it's turned right to the top because otherwise you won't be able to hear your voice over the gameplay. Bear in mind that when you play a game, um, a lot of games are on different levels of audio. Uh, so what I tend to do is I turn down, like I go into whatever game I'm playing and I turn it down to uh, the audio down to about 40%. So normally you have like music, a sound effects, and then like voices. And then you just turn it from 100% down to about 40 and then that makes sure that your voice and your friend's voices are nice and clear over the top of like people shooting and stuff going on in the game. Okay, so go back to your dashboard this time and go up to your party and then on the right hand side you'll see party settings. Go into there and then where it says allow your voice to be shared, this is really important. Everybody in the party who wants their voice to be recorded has to have this setting on. So if you click that and click always allow, it means whenever you guys want to record something you know that your voice will be recorded when you're in that party. So there you go, that's it guys. If you follow all of those instructions, unless there's a little mistake somewhere or there's a problem with your microphone, you should be able to record your party. I've tried this out with my friends and you can record our voices nice and loud and clearly because everyone's microphone level is high and all the settings are on correctly. So that's it. I hope this helps people out. I know you guys are going to get a bunch of fun out of this recording everyone together and stuff. It's just a great thing to do if you want to hang out with your friends or make videos with them or have a gaming channel on YouTube. So if this helps you guys out, please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe because there's a bunch of other tutorials and stuff that I do as well. Thanks guys.